Hey peoples, it's Titanium here, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Paper Mario. And yeah, let's just get right into it. Sniffle, Mario's belly hurt. I can't do a pinch. Alright, she doesn't really look the same in this game as she looks in others, so it's like harder for me to get that peach-like feeling. Uh, I'll try that. Everyone's in prison. Fuck him. The Mushroom Kingdom will be destroyed if Peach can take them away their power. Something must be done. Yeah, Peach's voice will definitely be like fluctuating throughout this playthrough. Jesus. If only someone can help me. Uh oh. Bowser's walking animation in, in this particular game. I bother me. My dear Princess Peach, how are you doing this morning? It's no use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. We are so high above this guy right now. Even Mario doesn't have a chance of reaching us up here. You know, Princess Peach, or Princess, as long as I have the Star Rod, no one in the Mushroom Kingdom can touch me. You know the power that grants everyone's wishes? It's mine! Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> Imagine what it's like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so upset because their wishes aren't being granted. How, how delightful. We deserve it for the way they've treated us Koopas over the years. You know, not wrong. If you, you know, want anything, all you gotta do is ask me, Princess. I can grant wishes. Of course I'll only grant requests that I like. Anyway, think about it. You take care, Princess Peach. Enjoy your stay here. You'll watch yourself, Princess. You better not cause trouble. <laughs> yeah, that's bullshit. Oh, please, if someone could help me. I don't want the damn Mickey Mouse here. Huh? Stupid star. Oh, uh, we're going to be hearing this song a lot throughout this game. But I, I, I like it. Hello, Princess Peach. Please, I you. My name is Twink. <laughs> oh God, I'm gonna have fun with you. But you're you're a star kid, aren't you? Aren't you? Think? I came from Star Kingdom to get your wish. It's our job to get wishes, you know. Oh, you came because I wished that someone could help me. Yes, of course. Oh, I love this song so much. Oh, that's just great. Thank you. For th yeah, thanks. Thank you. Whatever. Thank you. Dumb star. Here's my wish. Go right now and take the star back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do it? Ah, <laughs> uh, sorry, that's a little too much for a novice star like me. Maybe, maybe one of the more honorable stars here from Star Haven could get a wish like that. I'm so sorry. Please ask for something easy. Something a small star can do. Then, can you take me away from here? <laughs> Beat you fast. Everyone in my castle has been captured, and I have to save them all as soon as possible. Yeah, you have to save them. Okay, keep telling them something. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't bring that wish either. I'm afraid. Actually, I just called up. I just got called up to. Fuck, I can't. Really. Can't do big wishes yet. If I were a more splendid star, maybe I could actually help. It's alright, don't be sad, Twink. Mario will definitely do something to save us. Fucking puberty ruined my voice, damn it. <laughs> Can't do Peach anymore. That's to be so good at voice Oh, Twink, think you can find Mario? I want you to, I want you to get this time, I can't read! Fuck. This is a lucky star, isn't it? Okay, I'll do it, Princess Peach. I'll find the Mushroom Kingdom just as quick as I can. God. It's not like I'm struggling to do the voices either, I just can't. Oh, wait, Twink. Wait one second. Can you also... Please tell Mario that. I'm fine. And you shouldn't worry. Okay? You know that? Ah, no, Princess. That is beyond my power. <laughs> Definitely. Now, don't despair. I'll be back soon. So stay safe until I return, okay? God. So, I'm so bad at this. Mario, where are you? 
dead. He fell from the sky, from space. He was dead. And we are back. So yeah, in the last episode of Let's Play Paper Mario, we uh made it to Toad Town and oh, okay. Fuck. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry, so sorry. I'm gonna shield turn. Oh, it's your Mario, I do. Thank the stars, fair do. Thank the stars. How do you do? I'm Twink. Princess Peach asked me to bring you something. Bring something to you! Ah, here, yes, here it is. Here, take it. <laughs> this is it. Take it. I swear to God, I'm dyslexic. You got the lucky star, a star-shaped pendant. Let's see. Let's you use the action command. That's quite interesting, actually. That's a lucky star from Princess Peach. Now that it's yours, you can use the action command. May I take a moment to explain what the action command is? Hell no, I, I need to stop reading right now. This is important, Mario, I think you'll want to know about this. No! Oh, okay, great, go fuck yourself. Once you understand how to use the action command properly, you'll be even more powerful. Terrific, you'll be much tougher in battle now. Here you are! What? It can't be! You are following me! Where are you from? What a foolish star kid. I knew that if I followed you, I'd find Mario. And if I defeated Mario right now, I'll be famous! That's okay, Mikupa. They're showering me with praise, so give me a raise. Here I come! And here's another mini boss. Love this background, by the way. And it is a magic Koopa, not Karen. So, now that we have that star pendant thing, we can now do what the Mario, what every Mario RPG really is fam famous for. Action commands. So we use the jump, and right before the jump, press A. Okay, see, I didn't do it right, because I'm trash, but like, you know. This is a Magic Koopa. Magic Koopas use magical rods, max HP 8, max HP 8, attack power 3, so this is the strongest enemy so far. Magic attacks are no joke, Mario. You better take these guys seriously. Oh, what is that? Oh, you stupid. Come on. It's not cool. Uh, let's try that again. There we go. Right before the jump, you can double the damage. And Gubario actually has action commands too, so that's quite useful. So if you have trouble doing the action commands at first, just look at the icon. Okay. Oh, I'll, I'll, whatever, I'll the trailer. But the hammer actually has an action command too. For the hammer, you hold left and then you release one that like, shows up. And if you fuck it up, you'll only do it. But if you're having trouble, like, pulling off the action commands, just look to the A button to the side of the screen and press it right when it goes down. That'll. That, that's what. That's what. That's what's helping me, honestly. Because my timing sucks. Wow, we killed him. He is gone from- he is erased from existence. Mario is a murderer. Look at that, Mario, you're as strong as they say. I know that they will be able to defeat Bowser. Yeah! I'm going to return to Princess Peach's side. I'm not strong enough to really help her, but at least I can tell her you're okay. Well, Mario, see you later. Fucking Twink, man. Twink, Twink. Oh, what do you want? Oh dear, I almost forgot to tell you the message from Princess Peach. You idiot. I'm alright, so don't worry about me. That's exactly what she said. I get the feeling, though, that she's very lonely. Anyway, I'll do my best to help the both of you. But, but please, please be brave. You must save Princess Peach. So now my voice is starting to hurt. There he goes, back to Bowser's castle. What a brave little guy. Okay, Mario, let's get down to business. Shut the fuck up, Koopa! Don't you don't tell me what to do! So now that we're done with that, in the last goddamn episode of Let's Play Paper Mario, Game to Toe Town, I don't want to start here. That's pretty much it. <laughs> oh, Mario! Mario is looking for you! You live in that house with the spinning roof! He asked me to tell you to go to meet him at his house. I was just about to go look for you, but here you are! 
It's weird for Merlin to call somebody over to his house. He's a bit eccentric. Even when he gets visitors, it's rare for him to come out at come out of the house at all. <coughs> ah, he's gonna go fuck himself for a take a nap. Let me sleep. Hello, am I in the photos? Yeah, I don't sleep. Just heal me up. And again, no pillow. This is trash. Did you sleep well? I think your body and soul are refreshed. Your child also seems less violent. Alright. Gumbario, where did you go? Slow ass. Anyways, let's come in here. Merlin is out! Why do you get nothing? I'm telling you, he's out! Ow, dick! What the? Why is someone sleeping in front of my house? Wait a minute. That face seems very familiar to me. It's Mario, you fucking idiot. Oh, maybe? No. Yes, it must be. You're Mario. I've been waiting for you. You should come. You should have come earlier. Well, I had to take a nap. Well, you're here now. Come in. Where to begin? My name is Merlin. I am a wizard. When I was reading the stars the other day, an oracle came to me. What I discovered is very important and it concerns you. But before I tell you about it, there are other things of which I must speak. It's a very long story, but I'll try to shorten it. Where should I start? Oh boy, more dialogue. It was in the old days. One of my ancestors was up on Shooting Star Summit. And as usual, blah blah blah, blah but one thing had happened, blah blah blah, suddenly blah blah blah, a great, uh, I appeared and I, standing face to face. Then the far away blah, the peewis blah, what blah, raised me up blah, was amazing. I was still so young then. I believed in, but my heart was. And uh, uh, then the so so and that is all that matters. Huh? Hey, Mario, were you listening to me? Oh, oh yes, definitely. That actually he's like a running gag in the Paper Mario series where Mario just falls asleep as someone's telling a story. Oh, all right. So anyway, that is why I am able to help you. If you get lost during your adventure, you can come to me. You can break the path that you should take for a small break. Right now, your main goal must be to save Princess Peach as quickly as is humanly possible. But according to my second sight, your path must first take you to the great fortress of the Cooper Bros. To reach the Cooper Bros. fortress, head east on the road in front of the tow house. So yeah, Merlin is actually quite useful, unlike the other... I mean, I guess they're all useful, but... Merlin tells you about... Tells you where to go next if you get lost, so... Yeah. He did not mean to talk to you. I thought I knew everybody in this town, but I've never seen those dark toads before. You fucking racist. Seen them over by the Toad House? They look pretty nasty. Uh, they look nasty. I hope they don't take a fight. You are so racist. <laughs> or maybe I'm the racist one for assuming things. Don't want to go there, it's too dangerous. I really love this. Um, say something about Merlin. I, you can go, yes, you can go back to read Tessa in a minute. That's the problem, you shouldn't go ask Omni and Merlin for help. That would be really bad news for us. I mean, for you. Don't don't even think about it. Let's try to get the name again. Don't want to go out there, it's way too dangerous. Go into the. Sounds definitely different. Don't go. Well, I'm snitching. Don't care if I get stitches? Merlin! Yeah, I'm not going for you. Come again? Strange toads blocking the east side of the toad town. That shit ain't me. Well, that's ridiculous. Such a thing has never been heard of. Never! I'll get to the bottom of this. Follow me over there. I'll see what's going on. Oh, nice walking animation. <laughs> the walking animation is Let's follow him. He's not even walking. He's like sliding. It. Anyway, roast him. Are these the strange toads you were talking about? Yes! I told you, you can't pet. Take a. Hmm. You are toads, are you? Uh, we don't know who you're talking about. Yeah, with gifts. Us, anyway, we're just cute ordinary toads hanging out. And I have to sneeze. 
No. Fuck, I lost it. Reveal your true selves! Bibbity bobbity boo! This is what I thought. You are the Koopa Bros. How, how, how did you guess I was a You are perfectly disguised. Shucks, black, yellow, green, we retreat for now. All those wacky Koopa Bros. Mario, those imposters were none other than the Koopa Bros. You must pursue them to their hideout for K K the Koopa Bros Fortress. Oh, Mario, there's one part of your fortune I will reveal. To get to the Koopa Bros Fortress, you'll need help from a blue shelled Koopa. This is a strange portal in Koopa Village. You might find something that will clear it up. I must return home now. Bye, Merlin. So we can finally continue our adventure into Chapter 1. Storming Koopa Bros Fortress. Oh, baby. Let's start. And we still get this awesome music. And here's a new enemy. Ha. Oh, you are never the king. Shit. Okay, hammers don't affect Koopa. Whatever, I'll kill this. So, yeah, new enemy Koopas. Uh, oh, I'll just have Goombario explain it. This is a Koopa Trooper. Everyone knows Koopa Troopers. They're Bowser's followers. Nothing to be for attack power 1. Defense power 1. The shells are hard. If you can flip them over, the defense power will fall to zero and it will become much easier for you to defeat them. You can flip them with a plow block or with a jump attack. <laughs> uh, ah! Okay, see what I just did there is I used an action command to block attacks. They're not really given on when to do it in the game for like enemies attacks, but you just gotta <laughs> so. so these are actually, you know, they take uh, not a long time to take out, but like they could be annoying at first. So what you want to do is jump. And since I didn't do the action command right, I didn't get it to a second hand. But Gumbario won't fuck it up. Yeah. Gumbario is showing Mario what How embarrassing. And now the hammers work. So yeah. I don't know, I think the hammers actually do work if you, have, if you do the action command. But since it was preemptive strike, it would only do a one, but since it all its defense, it would. You guys get the gist of it. Son of a bitch. Okay, I don't know why I stopped talking there. I guess I forgot that I had to pull up. Okay, stupid. Get out of here. And that was the end of that fight. Okay. And again, there is a run feature, but you can lose coins. Like that. So, no, that's my illusion. This game is a chance to waste your turn. And we can get the dizzy attack badge. The room is a blow that can make an enemy dizzy and unable to move. Let's do it, since we have so much badge space. And we lost all our badge space. Too. Level up well spent. <laughs> And here we have a fright jar. Does the scary spirit appear and chase some enemies away? So let's let, let's head on. What's in here? A oh, power block. Oh, we're just getting tons of items. Okay, let's try jumping on it now. So now, when we enter battle, he'll already be face down, or not face down, but you know, on the ground. But I'll show off something with the power jump since it'll do more damage. Oh, bam! Three plus it's knocked down, plus I had one defense. So I guess by math, using math, that would be that would, that would do four damage. But I'm not trying to waste more at to figure that out right now, so let's just end these two. Coins, coins, coins. Oh no, we cannot get across. Better hit this tree. Oh boy, a button. I wonder what the button does. Oh look, I have bridge for me to cross over. Yay! Oh, I saw that too. Damn it! 
And I'm not even gonna be able to talk for long because there's another Goomba. And yes, I know I can be dodging these enemies, but... Where's the fuck that? Hopefully there are no more enemies. And I see you back there, Skippy Sheep. There's a Koopa up there, so let's go down here instead. <laughs> and... Oh no, a star piece we cannot get yet. I wonder if there will be something to help us get that later. Fairly soon. God, no! My streak! I am now pissed off. Everyone will feel my wrath. No! I always got the preemptive strike. This is bullcrap. No, you will die. You freaking suck. God, cuck! Stupid bitch. All of these blocks are going to have nothing. Okay, this one is close. Good. And son of a bitch. <laughs> All right, what's this? Toad Town, Village Fortress. Oh, um, why are you looking at me? Stop looking at me. Hold on, I think you run away. It gives you hearts. And that's all that you can get. That's the only one that's looking at you, so that's the only one you can do that with. Well, we gotta go to Cooper Fortress, <laughs> you better go this way. Kind of. Oh, no, you just, no, no, I'm dodging you guys now. Nope, no more. None of this. And we cannot reach that. I wonder if we'll be able to get that with it. Oh, fuck. No entry allowed, Mario. Here's truly the Cooper Bros. Oh, you son of a just one interruption after another. And oh, 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 that's just oh, this, this is great. This is this is great. And you want to know what made that battle even worse? It didn't take very long, but Gumbario couldn't attack because they were spiked. Yeah, no, no. Haha, you can eat them. Turtles do not understand the concept of jumping. Or in this case, pressing the VA. Fill me up. Thanks! Oh no, <laughs> looks like I need a nap. <laughs> Alright, better go to Koopa Village then. Hopefully, will we find something there that will help us get across that ocean? Give me the damn bitch. And we get the attack effects B dodge. Changes the sound effects when Mario's attack. And I don't think they cost any badge points, so let's, let's see what, what attack noises this gives us. And we cannot. I wanna hit the tree. Come on. I want you to let me hit the tree. Can I be? Are you mine? I'm not gonna come a village. I wish we could really welcome you, but we're in big trouble. Can't you see what kind of madness is going on? This village is in an uproar because of the fuzzies. You you don't know what fuzzies are. Like, don't you, Mario? Yeah, obviously. They look like this. New York! Mean guys, they're really naughty. Yeah, yeah I, I know. Place in the world. Oh, you bitch. Oh no! Seven Fuzzy! Get back here with my shell! Holy shit, this guy is. Give him back his damn shell! Cock. Oh, thank you, Mario. I owe you one. I just can't walk around with my shell on. Talk about embarrassing. Mario, be sure to keep your shell safe from fuzzies, alright? I don't know anyone do one. I don't know. Oops, you don't have one. Well, watch your overalls. Okay, buddy. There we go. So, yeah, this town is under attack. Oh, yeah, that pass. Thank you very much. And I don't need little cards. Oh, you get the dry tune. A very dry mushroom. Stories. One. 
Oh, that's going to be very useful. Yeah, I can't get myself someone to me. Thanks, Mario! This shell was made to order. That's why it fits me so well. I mean, how cool do I look? Alright, let's see what the item shop is looking like here. Um. Uh. Our inventory is. I'm, I'm not gonna. I'll, 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 we'll leave those. I don't really find myself buying items that much in this game. That is. Except one item shop it is in this game. Oh, we found a couple of those. The store is 3 Oh, they're totally losing Okay. Let's see. And, uh, hmm. What have we done in this episode so far? Uh, I guess we'll keep going a little bit. Surprisingly, these Bavamas recently ran away from the Cooper Bear's torches. I care things are much better here in the village. Fuzzies are running wild. Poor little Bavamas. He, huh? Huh, I see hang on. Huh, me? I don't leave my house because I can't bear it if the fuzzy made a fool of me. They probably have taken my shell and play with it. I know, I don't look cool without my shell. Nope. No, thank you, I'd rather just stay here and listen to me. You left listen. The cooler bros of the fortune worked us too hard. As far as they are concerned, laborers have no rights. I will never go back to work in such a terrible place. We're for bombs. We just ran away from the Cooper Bros Fortress. We thought we'd define We thought we'd at least find some peace here in the village. Boy were we wrong. The fuzzies are running wild around here. All they want is a little peace. Well how unfortunate. Alright, yeah, I guess I'll end it off here. I think this video was gone long enough. Let's see what we did. We've done we talk to Merlin. Oh yeah, we've done quite a bit in this episode actually. I'm just being done. It's the stupid interruption messing up my brain. Anyways, in the next episode of Let's Play Paper Mario, we will stop all the fuzzies from wreaking havoc in Koopa Village. See you guys then. Peace, peoples!